Gavin, hi. Adam from Hey You Guys. How are you doing? Hey You Guys. Hey You Guys. <laughs> hey you guys. Um, I wanted to ask you, this film's been in development for a long time and there's yes. been various sort of iterations and that have kind of stalled. Now. What was it that, how did you manage to get it up and running, basically? Well, I think uh, two things needed to happen for this film to be made. Um, one was it was, it, it's technically very complicated. So um, we needed visual effects to reach a point where we could really create photorealistic scenes of zero gravity and people flying around in space and so on. Um, I think if you try to do it 20 years ago, it would have been more difficult. Um, so, so we reached a sort of great place where visual effects is, is, is really a great place to deliver that. But more importantly, visual effects is, at the end of the day, no matter how good it is, is still just packaging for a story and at the heart of the story you have to have great characters with great actors and uh, and we did we have fantastic young cast with Asa Butterfield and Haley Steinfeld and um, and we have Harrison Ford and Sir Ben Kingsley and Viola Davis as these mentor manipulative characters that are training these young people and I, I think that the complexity of those relationships is what really drew me to the project as well as the opportunity to create big beautiful visuals and have a lot of fun. Of course, of course. Now are you a big fan of sci-fi in general or was there something about this material that really kind of grabbed you? You know it's an interesting question. I am not per se a sci-fi fan. For me I love the fact that this is a story that's set in the future which allows us to explore ideas that the story deals with in a way that would be perhaps too uncomfortable to deal with if we, sh if we explore them in, in the modern context. So for me it doesn't really matter whether a story is set in the future or set in ancient Greece or set on one constant or another. What matters is that the, the, the environment is, is, a, is, a, is a helpful visual way of telling what is essentially a timeless universal story about characters interacting with each other. Human beings have evolved their technology but emotionally we haven't evolved that much. We still get upset, we still get jealous, we still feel the need for love, affection, we still get angry, and we've been doing so since as far back as we can remember. And, you know, setting our stories, our myths, in different environments is wonderful to keep it fresh. But in a way, we're often telling stories that we people today can relate to um, in terms of the interaction of the characters. Okay, thank you very much, Gavin. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks a lot.